Hey guys, welcome back to The Sims 4 Let's Play, and, uh, yeah, we're continuing on with the life. Um, currently in the last part, um, we learned that we could use the, um, the radio to have the kids and teenagers to have fun when they're doing their homework, so that they won't be so bored when they're doing their homework, so that will actually help. A lot. Take a shower and then eat the last omelet. Okay, you can go ahead and cry. It's okay. You will actually eat some French toast. Oh. She is stressing. Uh oh, that broke. Ah, no. Try to keep your composure as best you can. Hey guys, it's the weekend! Ah, <laughs> And it's Maddox's birthday. Oh, good thing I checked. Um. <laughs> um. <laughs> okay, I'm nervous for today now. It's his birthday and Dina's supposed to be, you know, passing away really soon. And she doesn't have the long live, so she isn't going to get as lucky as Brody. So. That makes me really nervous. What are you doing? Stop that. Finish your stuff, please. And thank you. She's going to go ahead and eat hers. And you know, she's still asleep. So as soon as you get done eating, you're going to go and repair that, mop it up, take a, sh take a shower, and mop that up as well. Who turned on the radio? Turn that off. It's too early for that. <laughs> it says Brody. <laughs> She's still sleeping. She's getting her Z's. Today we're throwing a party for Maddox. Thank goodness that he gets to age up because now we'll actually have somebody to focus on when um, uh, Malik and Marisol goes to school. So, yeah. That's exactly what we want. Turn that back off. Empty that while you're at it as well. And then go mop up this. She needs to wake up real soon though. Because we need to get this party started. Uh, make a large surrealism painting. Just because. Both y'all are very sad, so neither one of y'all are going to make each other feel better. No offense. You will come back over here and bow for inspiration. Well, the house is clean. Brody did a good job. He can just sit down and watch a little bit of sports. I think it's about time for you to wake up and make a cake for your son. 
to make a new job. Um, we are actually going to make blue confetti cake for him. Because why not? She's already gotten better at the ball. I mean, the ball. <laughs> already better at the violin. It's like shooting archery now. Um, let's see. Yeah. As soon as she makes her cake and puts candles on it, we can actually throw a party. And it's about freaking time, if you ask me. Now we'll have something to do. <laughs> ring, ring. Who's calling? Uh, no, thank you. What an achievement. Malik finished writing an entire book. Good job. Write five good books. Okay. So, write a new genre. A sad book. Oh. Let's name it... The Grim Reaper Took My Mama. That is really sad. She got her inspiration. Now practice. Even though she's still really sad. Where are you going? We're gonna put this back in here. And we're gonna add birthday candles. Okay. And you are going to plan a social event. Hopefully, a, all the people we invite don't die at the party. We're gonna have a birthday party. The birthday sim is Maddox. The guests. That's it. Okay. Why not? And. Yeah really all we need. Everybody that we used to know is dead. We got nobody to invite to parties anymore. Oh my goodness. We need to get the young ones to go out and meet some people. Wow. I always make sure <laughs> I got the right sim, even though it clearly Typical says Maddox. Everybody, stop. It's a party. You need to come over here. Maddox aged up to a young adult. He is done with the homework. <laughs> If y'all could see me right now, I was doing like Broadway show dancing. <laughs> like I was uh, performing a uh, like a musical on stage or something. <laughs> Anyways, okay, what trait should she should should he have? Um, he's already got a creative art lover, and what else does he really need besides creative and art lover? We can make him, let's make him a perfectionist. It says, these sims take longer to craft items, but tend to make them higher quality, gain powerful movements after creating a high quality item, and gain negative movements after creating a low item. So that's really what we need because he needs to make um, 10 excellent paintings, so we need him to be a perfectionist. <laughs> Welcome to adulthood. Welcome to adulthood, Maddox. Yay! Play musical instruments for one hour. Alright. Maybe I shouldn't have made her quit. Go ahead, go back in there and play your musical instruments. 
you can actually come back in here and resume writing your book. You will actually, you know, put that back over here. Never mind. And, you know, call it a meal. You will actually sell your painting. Everybody's like, what a party. You don't have to grab a plate. Whoa, whoa, hello, cause. You don't have to grab a plate. You don't have to grab a plate. And you don't have to grab a plate. Okay. I want to get back to writing my book, dude. Get off my computer, dude. Thank you. Make a confident painting. Maybe you'll make excellent. Yay, we got the cake. She's playing her instrument. And watch her while you eat. Just want her. Oh, fried nerves. <laughs> Sorry, I'm still learning. And he's over here like, I'm trying to type. You're ruining my concentration. She's like, I'm sorry, this is my room. Get out if you want to talk somewhere else. <laughs> oh, siblings. I thought I told you you didn't have to grab a piece of cake, but I guess you wanted one anyway. Just like, hell, I'm going to die soon anyways. Might as well get fat. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay. It's like, for my birthday, all I want to do is actually stay in my room and paint. Okay? Compliment the birthday boy. Right. Come in here. Compliment his outfit. I'm gonna actually turn this down a little bit because... That uh, violin is actually pretty loud. Where are you going? Where are you going? You're supposed to compliment his outfit. Go in there and compliment his outfit. There you go. Compliment. Compliment it. You're gonna come in here and compliment his outfit. So that we can actually get this done. <laughs> the guests are over here doing their own thing. Compliment his outfit again. More friendly. Compliment his outfit again. Come on, Dina. Here you go. And then more funny telephony story. Where are you going? You ain't dancing. Get your butt back in here and talk to your mother. She's got to tell jokes. More funny telling inside joke. And more funny telling up not joke. <laughs> She's too tense to tell jokes, but he still found it funny. Well, that's where it stops. Because we currently have no games, and that's okay. Mm. Mm, paint a large impression. 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 Put up. Put up. Put up. Put up. Put up. Put up. 
Do you know when to work? What a party. Yeah, it didn't take long for her to catch up on her fall land skill at all. Oh, okay, what's this? Achieve level six in the instrument. Write four songs and earn five hundred dollars from licensed songs. Huh. She can make money by writing songs. Nice. Is she able to write songs yet? Nope. Or is it on this? Right. Mm. Nope. Okay. I guess she won't be able to um, write any songs until she gets to level 5 or 6. <clears throat> what an achievement. Alright. Why don't you come over here and actually watch the action show? He's standing outside, just minding his own business. Put away that cake and start, you know, start cleaning up a little bit. Clean that up. How long do you have? She has eight days. He has four. Cool. But <clears throat> I think that he should um, get him his, um, you know, his clothes planned out so that he don't look the same. We should like maybe cut his hair, make him look a little bit more, more like an adult rather than a young boy. And yeah, just do cool things like that. Maybe we can get his dad's hairstyle. But you know, have a little part of his dad in him. New novel. There's nothing quite like feeling the finish of the finish. It, okay, let me restart this. There's nothing quite like the feeling of finishing the last word. Cool. Nothing really happening at the party. Yay! Thank you very much for coming. Bye. I think we're pretty much done with birthday parties because we have nobody to invite anymore. So, yeah, we'll have to find a different method to, um, to celebrate a birthday. But, you know, since we, ha since we have Dine out, um, I think that, um, we could actually, um, you know, get a cake from um, a restaurant and yeah do that to change his appearance and then he will so thank you oh it's his grandma that keeps haunting them right watch the sports stretch we can either make his hair look like his father's or we can actually use jump. stuff for the new uh, stuff pack that came out that was um, 
the um, backyard stuff. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, what was it? I drew a blank. But currently, the backyard stuff, this is what they have for the backyard stuff. And honestly, none of these really scream um, Maddox to me. I don't know. And plus, he's got that yellow hair, and these just don't look that great on him with his yellow hair. So, let's actually find, um, let's find, like, a daring hairstyle for him, because he, he likes to paint and stuff. So, I think that it would be cool for him to have something daring like this <clears throat> when he goes and, you know, he paints and stuff. He's got a butt chin. <laughs> He's got a butt chin. Um, let's see. Type of clues. Something's wrong with you. You need some meat on those bones. <laughs> um, a chef jacket? No. So, so. It's like, I don't want to inspire to be a chef. Um... What screams Maddox? Maybe he could be like one of those artsy dudes that wear scarves and stuff, maybe? Yeah, we could put like glasses on him and things like that. He could be like, you know, like the, the nerd artists or something. That'd be pretty cool. Um, I don't really want him to wear tight pants, do. There we go. There we go. A lighter pants. Darker pants. I think darker pants because if he gets paint on him, it ain't gonna be really that big of a deal. So. And some shoes, some closed shoes, so that when, you know, he drops a little bit of paint here and there, it'll land on, you know, his shoe, rather than, you know, his foot. Some old shoes will do. Like, it don't have to be anything too fancy. Um... There you go. There you go. Then we can we can still make them more socks, cause why not? And then we can make him like a hipster nerd kind of. Make him look like you know he's got a little bit of style, but you know it's eh. You know, it's not really, you know, fashion-forward kind of stuff. It's more of his own style and, you know, it doesn't matter to him. Kind of thought process, I suppose. I think he looks really cute with glasses. <laughs> I think he looks really cute, actually. He's like, yeah, that's right, I'm cool. I can rock these glasses. <laughs> Um, let's go ahead and like, yeah, have them stuff like that and then put gl the glasses back on. Because I think he looks really good in glasses. Um, I think he needs to wear a shirt when he goes to bed, honestly. Because his sister will be like, ew, what are, you, what are you doing? Why are you walking around in that? <laughs> I don't want him to be like a prep for party wear. I want him to wear. Oh, I'm almost tempting to wear preppy stuff for him when he's at the parties. Because, you know, after all, you're supposed to dress up a little bit. Mm -mm. 
Yeah, and he can still wear his pants. And he can probably put on some nicer shoes. And then put his glasses back on. And we're going to have to fix his hair as well. Because his hair did not save for this for some odd reason. Mm -mm. Where's that hipster looking hair? There it is. There it is. I say, I think he looks really cute. Yeah, we can make him wear that. Why not? Why not? So, yeah. This is um, the young adult uh, Maddox, everybody. So, yeah. I really like his style. I think it's pretty cool. Because normally I don't really have... Um, too many sims that wear glasses enough and so I figured maybe this time you know we'll have a sim that wears glasses and look pretty darn cute in it so yeah I think those glasses complement his face really well <laughs> really well there he is there he is he looks pretty <laughs> he looks cool he looks like a cool dude okay. <clears throat> well I'm gonna stop it here you guys and thank you all so much for watching and if you like this part please remember to like and slash or comment and I'll see you in the next part everybody have a great day